<laughs> little parenting tip there, I guess. <laughs> little, little ones. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, I read a lot of kids' stories, you know? I read a lot of fairy tales. You guys know the story of the princess and the pea? You guys know yeah. That? I had something similar to that happen to me last night. Laying in bed, tossing and turning. Finally, I get up, I look under the mattress, and there's a dead cat. Uh, that was for you, man. You get me. I get you. Took the kids to Disney this year. Uh, I'd never been to Disney before, never even been to Florida, and we drove down. Uh, anyone else ever do that drive? Yeah. 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 Seemed like as soon as we crossed the state line into Florida, we kept seeing the same three billboards over and over again. Uh, the first kind were these anti-abortion billboards. And each one has like a different fun fact about the development of a baby. The second kind were for this place called Club Risque. Yeah, where women bear it all. It's got like a silhouette of a naked chick on it. And then the third kind was for this like medieval time sort of restaurant. It's got like a jester and a wench holding a turkey leg. So as I'm driving down the interstate, I'm thinking, you know, if I was a pregnant woman who was debating whether or not to terminate her pregnancy, these signs would make that decision that much tougher. Because you know? on the one hand, a baby has a beating heart 18 days after conception. But on the other hand, that kid could grow up to work at Club Risque or Medieval Times. <laughs> Apparently in Florida, your only career options are dork, slut, or aborted fetus. <laughs> and that's my abortion joke. 